Artista and Downey. This is the intersection. Okay, there's a lot of road work going on. Downey and Artisha. Look at that. Downey and Artisha. This is the only doghouse signal you'll find in, on this street only. This is very uncommon on this street. This is in Bellflower on this side. And this is Long Beach, Long Beach on the other side. The northbound does not have a green arrow at all. So, let's take a tour of the intersection. Downey and Artisha. The three directions have dog houses in the five section on the left side of the of the street. This is in the Bellflower side. This is in Bellflower side. This is in, this is the only location to find a dog house in Bellflower. <coughs> left turn you on green, see? The other direction does not have an arrow at all. So I'm gonna take a tour of the intersection real fast and you'll see. Downey and Artisha. Alright, this is this is the eastbound side and the westbound side. The construction over there on Artisha. It's real it's the, the area will be closed because there'll be construction. Downey and Artisha. This is the intersection. Okay, this is El Pollo Logo, McDonald's and Popeyes and Rally. Four restaurants on this intersection. There's Starbucks on the on that across the street. This is a lot of restaurants in this intersection. Popeyes, Rallies, El Pollo Loco and McDonald's. There's four of them on this intersection. Okay. See? Green light and the green light on both directions. No arrow. I don't know why. This is like the one in Normandy and Carson Street, but this is a similar setup. This is the opposite version of Normandy Avenue, just like the one in Los Angeles. These lights are too fast. This is a five section light. Let's take a look. See, left turn yellow green and bellflower. This is the only intersection in both directions. This is the only intersection in bellflower. Downey and Artisha. Because it's like, these lights are very like 15, year, 15 years old now. It's like 15 years old already. It's like it turned 16 years old today in 2007, I think. This light came, it's there in the 2000s, the 2000s. So, the, this is, this is the, these lights are changing very fast at night. See, traffic getting light. All right. So, this is like the setup on Normandy and Carson Street. Where I used to go there a thousand times already. This is a similar setup. Yup, this is the whole intersection. Artisha and Downey. Dog House in Belfar. This is the only location in the city. Watch this. This is the five section version. It's connected together. See? Southbound directional Downey Avenue. The visors are cut. The, the, tongue, the visors are cut so you'll be able to see the light in the other direction. The, uh, the opposite direction at night. These visors are cut in half so you'll be able to see the other direction at night. The traffic signals color at night. The indication from the other direction. Yup. Green light on both directions. Eastbound and westbound. The arrows are not working so this is a tour. Only the um, intersection, okay. So, let's let's take a look of the intersection. These lights are turning very fast. Just like the ones on Normandy and Carson Street. It's, it's the only reason why I come here to see this intersection. Yup, this is a gas station on this corner on this intersection. Downey and Artisha. This is the only doghouse signal in Bellflower that you will find. Alright, let's take a closer look at the intersection from a distance. So let's take a look, shall we? So, <laughs> this is it. Oh no, that's a bus. I thought it's a truck. 
all right i'm not sure if the arrows were turned on because it's very difficult at that moment at this time to see the arrows trigger it's very difficult on in any direction see wow two a pedestrian signal it looks bright at night it's red on there a dog house on both directions yep <laughs> Downey and Artisha. See? These arrows are keep are keep triggering every single time. Doghouse version. We're just on the right side. Doghouse. It looks beautiful at night. I have no idea when the which direction have an arrow. I have no idea. It's hard to tell. <coughs> yep, 141. Sorry, I actually say the bus number. Alright. Hard to tell which one has an arrow. Okay. This reminds me of the intersection at Normandy and Carson. This is an inspiration. Inspiration. This is in Belfar, not in Long Beach. Long Beach is in the other side of the, of the street. The, opposite, the other side of the street. That's when you cross it, go to Long Beach. This is in the Belfar area. This is the only way to find one in Bellflower. The dog house is in the city of Bellflower. Watch the dog house again, so I'll show you. See? Look, there's a doghouse. Yep. Alright, this, this is in the Bellflower area. Oh my god, look at that car. It's old school. Yeah, very old school. Awesome. I haven't seen this car in a long time. A classic beauty. Alright, watch this. Yep. Wow. Alright. I don't really care if this arrow gonna trigger, I don't know which direction. It doesn't do that because the one in Long Beach is similar. This is not the one in Signal Hill. That's why. I'm not sure which intersection in Long Beach. This is the only street in, in the city, in Belfar. Downey and Artisha. This is the street name. Wow, it looks like... There it is. See, it keeps doing that. See? All right. Dog house again. All right. Okay, now the other girl has a green light. Okay. That's the, that's the tour of this intersection, Downey and Artisha at night. These are the cars. We don't really know if the arrows will turn on on this intersection. They don't turn on just like the ones on Carson and Vermont earlier in in harvard medical ucla they are they just do the same thing they don't turn on when this one vehicle in the turning lane they don't trigger on both directions because we are not really sure so have a nice day good night